to do a story that involves the old and the new, that is also culturally relevant. I like seeing two different sides of the same world, develop two different characters, each one representing sort of a different era, where the grandmother represents the old generation and the granddaughter represents the new. And then we introduce a bachelor, which is this foreign element that kind of interrupts their usual balance. Before we pitched it, I had a storyboard then, but it was not complete. The thing is, with storyboard, it's never finished. <laughs> so once I finished it, I pitched it to the team. We were gonna have a um... I sit down with the whole team and watch the animatic in about half an hour or whenever Iman gets here and then we're going to decide on what stays and what goes um, in the same and then the team gave me feedback to apply to the storyboard we kept going in that direction for about maybe two weeks so let's say we had I think about six storyboard sessions until everybody was satisfied with the final result Drawing the most depressing scene in the whole thing. But I'm not in a depressing mood, so it's hard to get in touch with the character. And then it's finished. <laughs> when I have the team's approval. I started on this project working as a trainer where I helped uh, Fatima shaping the story as part of our animation production course. When the project started, I um, worked as a capacity of a producer where I helped with the scheduling, with the staffing, with the budgeting. And um, in particular, my job was to make sure that the deadlines would be kept. From time to time, I had to do a meeting with uh, Oliver to check if the project is progressing well and what are the problems that we we're facing and how to solve them. So each day, I check with the artist what did they finish and if they're catching up with the deadlines and who's doing what. The art director would give me the layouts of the scenes that we need. The backgrounds for. I would do some research on how the houses would look like back then because it's an Arabic um, Gulf related thing. With the reference pictures that I would get, I would have an idea of how to um, construct the background. I'm doing some backgrounds. أخذنا references من بيوت العربية القديمة الإمارات رحنا شوي على ثيم ألوان العربية وألوان ترابية اعتماد كان لنطلع الفيلينز لكن ماتيريال بالتكشور والستايل كان شوي artistic وديتيل شغلتنا نحن الانيميتر نسوي testing للانيميشن نخلي الشخصية تتحرك بس طبعا مو بحركة عادية لكل شخصية لها طابعها الخاص كيف تمشي كيف البرسوناليتي مالها يعني شخصية الجراند ما غير عن شخصية الحفيدة My experience on the project was a very good one because it was a very strong team I worked with everyone before in the training so I had great faith in all the people being involved and I knew exactly where the strengths and weaknesses to be honest I didn't have to do much other than making sure that the engine keeps going and that it keeps producing and uh, doing the job. Some of them they stayed very late and some of them they came very early at the morning. Most of the time I came in the morning uh, even before I switch on my screen I'd find uh, sticky notes from the team members saying how many frames they've been working through the weekends or last night. Uh, I would love to work with the same people I worked with in this project. Uh, I find them really cool and fun. We had an open communication, so whenever we had a problem with any of the project assets, we would sit together and share ideas and give feedback to help improving. Oliver was also supervising some of the animation, he was constantly giving us feedback when we needed it. And then when you end that with a focus, then it's a work better. Our composer, uh, Mohamed Altaf, was very helpful in narrating the story through music while at the same time keeping it light and keeping it culturally inspired, which is very, very difficult to do with Arabic instruments and Arabic music. 
اكبر تشالنج كان اني بجي من دبي كل يوم على ابو ظبي من اول ما باكل ليد انيميشن بعد ما كنت ستودنت ذا اكويبمنت ريلي سلو اند ذا بروجرام واز هارد تو مينتين وي فينيشد وي تيك اور اول ذا كلر وان بوت اب ذا بلو بوت اب ذا I would love to be involved again in a project such as these, hopefully um, with the capacity where I can train them to the next level, also bring people into the project that can teach new aspects of animation that um, people who haven't experienced yet or not experienced enough. I hope that um, this project will prove that talent is here. You guys did a great job. Well done.